Hey there guys and welcome to another Factorio Mod Spotlight. I'm Exterminator and thank you for joining me. And today we are covering the Edit Blueprints mod. And uh, this one is actually created by one of our own Factorio devs, uh, V, who you all probably know pretty well. I've toured multiple of his bases, uh, you know, pretty well known dev. And uh, this is a fantastic mod, something I have wanted in the game and I'm sure many others have wanted in the game for a super long time. Uh, as you may tell from the name, this allows you to edit blueprints uh, to a much more fine uh, detail than what would normally be allowed. So normally uh, in vanilla, uh, when you right click on a blueprint, you can take stuff out and then you can undo those changes, um, but you can't ever actually add something or change settings like of a combinator or an asserter. Uh, you know, and there's been a lot of times, at least personally, where I've wanted to actually add things to a blueprint without adding them uh, in the actual world. And this mod allows you to do that. So it adds a icon right up here um, you need a blueprint book or blueprint um, in your cursor to modify it. And you then click on this and it will take a second and it brings you into, basically this is a second surface uh, is how it handles things. A second surface in the game with editor mode, um, which obviously lets you put down anything you want. Um, in this case, that's not really cheaty because it's not giving you free items when you actually place the blueprint. You're obviously going to have to spend the items to build the things that are in the blueprint as normal. This just allows you to edit it further. So for now, say for example, I wanted to, uh, I don't know, let's just say maybe I just want to add um, some exportation for some reason into a uh, box right here. And we do this, you can do all the hotkeys, Q I just did over this, goes here, boom, I now have that. You know, real simple change. Uh, you know, maybe I want to just add some more belts here like this Super nice super easy. Uh, I mean heck if I wanted to I could just build a whole nother setup in this blueprint uh, You can also edit things uh, like combinator settings if you so choose so we can go in here and you can actually change a combinator setting uh, Within here, so let's just say for example, let's just say robots are less than 15 output It really just doesn't matter anything uh, and then even inserters, I would imagine you could change. So if we go, let's just take a different inserter, go here. Uh, we can just set up anything here, really, just as an example. Um, and then you can discard it, which will just get rid of the changes. It doesn't delete your whole blueprint. It just gets rid of the changes in here. Reset it, which will undo everything you've done, but leave you in here. Uh, I'm not going to do that. Or you finish. Um, confirm changes and exit the editor. So we're going to do that. And you can see all these changes are now in place and the combinator and inserter actually took the settings I gave it. And this is fantastic. Um, now there's a few caveats here and a few additional things I'm gonna just read directly from the mod portal for you. Um, it's untested for multiplayer, but uh, he says he would assume the editor could just unpause time in the editor to also unpause the main surface and let others continue playing. So basically what happens um, is this actually pauses the rest of the game. Um, the game automatically pauses when you enter the editor, so you won't miss anything, like if you're being attacked or whatever. Um, so that's why maybe it's it's unsure in multiplayer, but definitely in single player this works. Um, and then features, so you can blueprint editing, blueprint book editing, support for infinite blueprint sizes, support for mining drills, support for offshore pumps, support for landfill, um, automatically constructing trains from ghosts. So if you can you ghost in some trains, uh, it will construct them. Uh, when you place it down, GUI allowing to reset, discard, to confirm changes. Modded entities should be supported, but there will probably be some weird edge cases, um, obviously, that he didn't think of initially. So if that if you run into them, report them. Um, the known issues are there's no integration for the Blueprint library. Um, and if you had the edited Blueprint linked in your quick bar, the link will be lost with editing. So if I had one of these linked in here, like this Blueprint book, um, and I edited it, the link here will be lost. It doesn't necessarily, it doesn't delete the blueprint book, just the link. Um, and those are really the only caveats. Uh, overall, absolutely fantastic mod. Like I said, this is something I've wanted in the game forever, basically. Um, and uh, V has brought it in with a mod. So there you go, guys. It's really great. Um, in terms of mod settings, as you can see, there's nothing. Uh, it's just very straightforward, as I showed you. Um, should work with most mods. If you have issues with it conflicting with other mods, definitely report it on the mod portal page for it. And uh, as far as I can think of, that's everything I need to show. I mean, it's just fantastic. It just lets you edit and add and change things however you want to the finest detail. Um, I think that's going to do it, guys. 
as always, thank you so much for watching. Please leave your thoughts and questions. If I did forget anything or you have further questions down below, there's a link, of course, in the description to the Mod Portal page where you can check this out. And uh, I really, really look forward to uh, what he plans to do with it, um, future plans or fixing bugs, see if there's any extra functionality that would be convenient. And he may try to improve performance a bit. You can see with a little bit of a lag getting into the surface, second surface, uh, probably would be worse with bigger blueprints, but not that huge of a deal. Anyway, thank you guys. Take care. Um, I really appreciate you watching. And until next time, I look forward to seeing you all. And do take care.